what is your role tomorrow, Coach? Well, to lead the workout. You know, I'm I'm excited about having the opportunity. I, I know Colin. Um, you know, uh, when he was coming out of Nevada, uh, Reno, and obviously a sensational player and a really good person and um, spent time with him that way. Wish we had drafted him at the Raiders. Um, and obviously have watched his career. You know, the guy who played in the Super Bowl. So he's very talented, uh, can make all the throws. I know when he was coming out, he was very athletic. And I'm just, uh, you know, delighted to have an opportunity to be a part of this. It's a long layoff, though, Coach, not playing football. Oh, no, it is. You know, there's no question about that, you know, and uh, obviously competitive football. Uh, at that too but uh, to me in my mind just knowing Colin a little bit if any guy can do it it's him you know I've seen guys take time off before and sometimes they come back better I've seen guys that take time off and they don't come back at all so somewhere in there is where he will be more important the interview process or the workout in your opinion I think it's the workout I think this is um, about the workout I think all the other things that need to be talked about they will be in time but I think that's somewhat behind us let's let's find out if he has the skill uh and desire and the determination to to play at this level again and that will somewhat show itself and then I'm sure everybody else who has the interest will dive into the other things that need that they need to dive into do you think there is a team right now that wants to sign Colin Kaepernick before this workout even happens I think there are. I mean, I think people wanted to know more about uh, where he is, you know, as far as football. Does he still have the arm talent, the athleticism that he's shown before? Um, I think this, you know, gives the league an opportunity to put some of the things that have, that have happened behind us, you know, and move forward. And if his skill level is where it needs to be, hopefully this leads to an opportunity of him playing again in the National Football League. What is the one drill, if you were a coach who was going to scout him, that you want to see how well he performs in? Uh, you, you guys, it's really interesting, Dad, because I think the most important thing will be um, his, you know, his conditioning, you know, and mm. if he still has the arm talent, you know, if, you know, there's a lot of people, like you said, you know, you've been out of football for quite a while. Have you really worked at a level that's going to give you a chance to go into a National Football League organization and compete at a high level. And most guys is really interesting are normally out of shape. They're not in football shape, you know, to make, you know, 60, 70 throws drop back that many times being a shotgun and have the mental discipline that it takes to, to play at a high level plan and play out. That's going to be really important. Does he run a 40? Uh, I don't know that. I have not uh, been a part of that part of the discussion. You know, my thing will be leading um, the drills as far as throwing and the things we will ask quarterback to do on the field. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune in to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV. Stream for free on VR Live or download the Dan Patrick Show app.